Hello folks, take a guess what we've got back in at Urban Rider. The thumbnail and the title may well have given it away, actually. So it's a pretty short quiz, but it's Roland Sands design. We have the Truman here in the studio as an example of that, but it's been far too long. The reason being that the safety standards changed and obviously they needed to stick them through the new safety standards. So this jacket has now achieved level A standard and it's got level one armor in the arms. That's the elbows and the shoulders, that's Sastec armor. And that's one of the requirements actually of CE level A certification. There is also a pocket for a back protector if you need. Now, even though it's been through that safety testing, which is often quite expensive, the jacket itself still comes in at a respectable 325 pounds. So it's a nice affordable jacket as well. Roland Sands are a really cool brand. I'm sure you've come across them in the past. If you haven't, do check them out, I urge you because they've got some great content actually as well, but some awesome designs, custom bikes, nice clothing at the same time. So the Truman is a great example of that. This is kind of unique. It stands out from the rest of the crowd. Even though it's a wax cotton finish, a wax cotton jacket, they do things in their own way. So this is an 11.5 ounce wax cotton material. It is actually slightly lighter feeling than that. I don't know whether it actually does come in at that kind of weight, but it certainly isn't an uncomfortable weight to move around. You've got some extra details across this. You've got the leather on your shoulders and your elbows on the impact zone, so a little bit more safe because it's a bit obviously thicker in those areas, but just a nice accent as well. You've got the Roland Sands logo on the side there, and this comes in either Ranger that you can see here, which is just a really cool name for a color, but obviously this is more of a khaki kind of color, and it comes in a black as well, a bit more of a worn in or faded black. They've both got this kind of marble effect to them, and that really lends itself to the overall aesthetic, really pretty. That wax cotton has a water repellent coating, so it is water resistant. The jacket itself, quite obviously, isn't a waterproof jacket, but it should at least do you if you're caught out in a shower. There's some extra details across this. You've got some really nice brass details across there on the snaps. You've got the RSD logo, which stands out, just looks quite cool. You've got a load of other brass details across it as well. You've got these zips going around. You've got a few different pockets going on. So you've got a bigger one there on the right hand side of your breast pocket. You've got some asymmetry. So you've got this angled zip pocket on the left side, slightly smaller. You probably won't use that all that often, but it's nice to have it all the same. You've got two zip pockets around your waist, decent kind of size. And you've actually got a zip pocket on your right sleeve as well, which does come in handy from time to time. That's a nice little feature. You've also got these zips at the top of your arm. Those aren't pockets, those are vents to allow some airflow through to cool down your arms and the rest of your body. You've got some zips around your wrists as well, so you can get easy access in and out. You've got the Roland Sands stitched logo on the left sleeve at the same time. And then you've got these buckles around your waist if you want to tighten that in and make it a bit more snug. You've also got some pleats around your shoulders to give you a bit more flexibility and more range of motion in your back and around your arms. You've got this drop back design to the back of it. You've got this relaxed neckline. It's a pretty classic cut, quite a short cut, but a really nice jacket to look at. And dare I say, it gets even better on the inside. If you are to open this up, you'll see their lovely gold satin liner, which is really comfortable, but it's very eye-catching as well. It really does stand out. You've also got a pocket on the inside, again, on your left side, and then you've got these elasticated net pockets around your waist. Probably won't use those too much, but it's nice to have them all the same. Of all the Roland Sands jackets, I think this is the one that catches my eye the most. It just speaks to me for its style, and I like to go for something a little bit different. Don't always like to go for leather on my jacket, so I like the, uh, the wax cotton finish to this one. Now, being an American brand, I would say they are slightly on the larger side for the fit. European designs, European brands tend to be a slightly snugger fit. These are actually probably one size larger than you might expect. So I'm a 38 inch chest. I usually wear something around a medium and actually the small, if I want to get a tailored fit, something that's quite snug, I'd go for the small. The medium that's on the mannequin does fit me, but I probably wouldn't go with that one unless I just wanted it a little bit more comfort moving around. If you are at all unsure though, obviously follow the link in the description, go to our website, you'll find a really accurate size guide, especially when you're buying online, you wanna make sure you get the right size. Now, if you've got any questions or comments, if you're happy to see these back at Urban Rider, feel free to drop that down below. And for more of the world's finest riding gear, stay tuned to Urban Rider. Thank you.